Steph Curry's thirst post to Aisha Leaves fans, speculating baby number five is on the way. Stephen Curry, the star of the Golden State Warriors, has never held back from expressing his love and respect for his wife, Aisha. He not only discusses how much his family matters to him, but also how the mother of his four children is at the heart of it all, as evidenced by his heartfelt social media posts and candid interviews complimenting her. Even though his youngest child, Caius, is only a year old, a new post has some people wondering if he's ready for yet another family member. The NBA All-Star shared a gorgeous Halloween photo of Aisha dressed as a pirate. She was dangling over a couch and sitting on a table with her legs wide. Steph wrote in the photo's caption, Aisha, Aisha, my matey. All right, idiotic times are over. His 58 million followers started to comment as soon as he posted, with many speculating that he might be ready for his fifth child. One reader wrote, My boy is trying to have another child, while another said, Your new baby is only six months old, bro. Bro is literally building an army of shooters, added a third commenter. Others added further jokes, such as, Bro, you have 4,000 children, and Curry sitting Aisha down for nine months after this. Given that the Currys have four children, Cannon, Six, Ryan, Nine, Riley, Twelve, and the new baby boy due on May 11th, the final statement seems over the top. However, it appears that the two know how to keep things interesting even if they are the parents of an almost starting team. Aisha also shared photos from Halloween. Her husband and she were pirate mates in her movies. She used the R sound associated with mythological pirates to reference her husband's team in the caption of the photo, which read, Date night with my Golden State Warrior. It's interesting to note that some of her 7.9 million fans noted their chemistry and speculated that she might be expecting another child. While the vast majority of the posts focused on her new hair color and how adorable she looked in her costume, one reader remarked, Baby number five gonna be on the way you dressing there. Happy Halloween to one of the best couples ever, one commenter even said. It appears that Aisha is simply getting used to having a baby back in the family and enjoying how her other kids are taking on the role of siblings while others are urging for a new child. We're lucky. All the kids have embraced the new baby, and my girls, being a little older, have even been helping me around the house, she added in an interview with She Knows. She jokingly said, The baby has made back to school so much more exciting. After school, the kids can't wait to get in the car and kiss him. The Currys first believed they were done having children after having three, but the little one has added a lot of enthusiasm to the family. However, after that? According to a March 2024 interview with Sweet July, the point guard glanced at his wife and it was on. For a long time, Stephen and I believed our relationship was over. Three, that's it. We won't do this again, we declared. The chef said, then, last year, we looked at each other and decided we wanted to do this again. Fans are excited to see what the Curry family will do next. But for now, they appear to be content to enjoy their vibrant home, complete with three children, a baby, endless laughter, erotic photos, and passionate love. One of the most successful basketball players in the modern era is Steph Curry. The dynamic basketball player won the MVP award at the 2022 NBA All-Star Game, and is most known for his unstoppable three-point shooting. To put it briefly, he is an unstoppable force on the floor and is having a career that most ballers can only imagine. Steph is well known for his idyllic marriage outside of the game. In addition to having three adorable children, he and his spouse, Aisha Curry, co-host the HBO Max celebrity quiz show About Last Night. Aisha, for her part, has been occupied with creating a remarkable culinary empire, the childhood sweethearts are genuinely enjoying life together and supporting one another through every stage of their journey. There are some lesser-known details about even the most well-known love stories. The narrative of Stephanie and Aisha's marriage is a timeless tale of love, replete with family, faith, history, and unwavering support for one another. Do Aisha and Steph have an open marriage? By the standards of celebrity couples, Aisha and Steph Curry appear to have a pretty darn ideal relationship. However, that doesn't mean they don't deserve to be the subject of conjecture. In 2021, Du Moi, an Instagram gossip page, posted a blind item on their stories from an anonymous source about a well-known NBA couple who weren't as faithful as they seemed, according to the Jasmine brand. The article stated that they both have side hookups and flings, but keep it very private to keep up the perfect family image they show to the world. According to the Jasmine brand, a lot of people thought it had to do with the marriage. 
Aisha was compelled to respond to the rumors on Instagram a month later. A since-deleted remark on a post honoring her husband's GQ cover story chastised her for desiring an open relationship with him. If I were him, you would have been sent to the streets already, the statement went on. Aisha was quick to refute the claims, and it looked like the shade room took a screenshot of the exchange. She said, Don't believe everything you read? In response to the criticism, you realize how absurd that is? Don't treat my marriage with such disdain. Thank you, and please. Mrs. Curry quickly put an end to those rumors. Let's move on. Then. Steph has a thing for his wife's feet. Since Aisha Curry is incredibly beautiful by most standards, her husband probably finds a lot of her body parts quite attractive. Although Steph Curry has stated publicly that he values her intelligence and skills just as much as her beauty, there is one body area that he finds particularly attractive and it's probably not what most people would think it is. Steph adores the feet of his wife. Aisha actually takes care to take pictures of her toes for him because she is aware of how much he adores them. My husband really loves my feet, and so the light hit in them just right that day. And so, I was like, let me just snap this photo and send him a picture of my feet, she said, showcasing a photo of her tootsies on an episode of the daytime talk show The Real. Stephen made a small Instagram shout-out to his favorite body part a few months before his wife joined him in his feet fervor. He captioned a photo of himself posing hungrily next to Aisha, who was wearing new clothes and had socks on her feet. I just want to get that foot-popping love in my life, demonstrating his love and laughter at the same time. Aisha had a no-athletes policy. It is difficult to accept that Aisha Curry formerly prohibited athletes from dating. Fortunately for Steph Curry, that policy was a complete failure. Aisha talked more about her dating behavior in high school when the two of them appeared on The Tonight Show. The best-selling cookbook author told Jimmy Fallon a story about how she was told as a teenager to list the characteristics of a perfect date. She wrote No Athletes in capital letters. I don't know why this was a high school activity that the theater teacher had us do, but she had us write down what we were looking for in a significant other, she said. Those were the days of high school musical. I was in my feelings, and I wrote that on there. So it's like one of those things. Be careful what you say because God definitely has a sense of humor. For the record, they're definitely not siblings. Instead of looking alike, couples want to look attractive together. Although Steph and Aisha Curry are both attractive and make a good relationship, some people, specifically members of the couple's own family, seem to think they seem more like they share DNA than a bed. Even as a bashful, church-going adolescent, Aisha believed her future husband, Steph Curry, was a dreamboat. She told people that when she first saw the young NBA star, he was the cute boy at church that all of the girls were obsessed with. The love connection was not immediately apparent to her relatives. Aisha really revealed to Jimmy Fallon on The Tonight Show that her parents' initial response to Steph was quite different. She elaborated, I just remember my family saying, he looks like your brother. She continued by saying that while she doesn't notice the similarity, everyone in their family does. Look, we took a 23 and me test and we're in the clear, the clever woman joked. Everything is good. Aisha won Steph's heart with prayers and candies. Steph Curry's mother isn't afraid to express her admiration for the couple's love, and his parents are overjoyed about their son's relationship. It's really lovely. Sometimes I'm like, are you serious? After giving you a serious look. Really? They're flawless. Marcus Thompson poked fun at Sonia Curry in his book, Golden, The Miraculous Rise of Steph Curry. Sonia prayed for a while that her son would only concentrate on basketball and education, and not on girls. One pivotal spring morning, she changed her mind and asked her son to see his partner instead. Steph had moved to Los Angeles by the summer, where he got back in touch with Aisha Curry. In the past, the gourmet entrepreneur had tried to use candy to secure her man in an extremely sweet attempt to win over her church crush. On The Tonight Show, he revealed, She was the candy plug for a long time because I love Canadian candy. Just bring back candy from Canada and we'll get off to a good start. Not everyone was as impressed, though. 